Is everyone here? Ah, fuck. Right. <sighs> Harley. Hello. Brian. Hi. Scott. Hello. Pi. Present. Holy shit. 11. Only took an hour. All right. Uh, I guess we start. Goombario, the precious little first companion you ever get in the game. What a what a punk. Named after you. His parents said, mm, my kid gonna be just like Mario. That's why all he can do is jump. All right, so this guy's got more dialogue than every other character, like, put together in the uh, game. It's because he's a big nerd. Yeah, all the Tellers yeah, will like, increase day rank by default. Oh, yeah. fucking like, Steam! Face! Like, how old is this dude, right? Like, <sighs> uh, God. Sorry, Gohan? Gohan? Gohan. He's all right. Uh, I wouldn't put him as high as Goombario, though. He doesn't get good until later in the game. Pi, what were you saying? Goombario's pretty high on the like, he, He's, like, probably, like, early teenager, right? Like, right. at best. But, like, imagine knowing that much information at that age when you're just in some little village in the middle of nowhere. Why does he know so much? He's, he's a walking book. He's probably on 4chan all the time trying to get all the information. Yeah, he's gotta be online. Cause sometimes from Toad Town, he's like, oh, I know this dickhead. Um, my mom talks to them sometimes when she goes into Toad Town. But then when you're in Shiver City, he doesn't have an excuse. He just knows who they fucking are. Yeah, where does he, wait, where does he get all this information? What if he's just coming right. up with it on the spot? He doesn't <laughs> actually <laughs> know anything. And then Mario just takes it at face value, like, <laughs> <laughs> I've never been here before. Scott, can you do that again? <laughs> <laughs> like, Tattle's, Tattle's super useful, of course, obviously, right? Like, of Tattle's course. a classic ability. Honestly, if it wasn't for the, what, what is it, the peekaboo badge? Like, let's be honest, no one used Goombario after you went and bought that badge and had it equipped for the whole game. I did. Yeah. I actually thought, like, man, this badge sure would save me a turn in battle, but then I'd miss out on all the souls, so I, like, purposely did not use it or even buy it. How many of the logs do you remember? The logs? Um... Only from TTYD. <laughs> No, 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 I remember some, I remember some. That's Red Goomba, he's a bully. That's Blue Goomba, he looks like Red Goomba, but he looks a little sick, so I think he has less HP. Wait, is that real? Yeah, yeah, he actually says the blue one looks a little, like, unhealthy. <laughs> and I feel like he has less HP. There's no way he would be, like, below average, right? Like, he's, 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 got, he's got the classic, you know, power bounce fantasy where you can do a lot of damage potential on him. Who you're gonna use early game, you're gonna use, like, Goombario, right? Who you're gonna use in the first chapter before you get Koops? Probably Goombario. And after you get Koops, probably both of them, right? Yeah. Cooper, Come on, get it right, guys. Fuck, did I, did I do it backwards again? Yeah. Whatever. Dude, it's okay. Uh, guys, we're, we're about mistake. to drag Koop. Koop hold on, hold on. Okay, we, we, we gotta figure out what to do with this dickhead. With this Is actual that... walking dickhead. He's pretty B tier. He's, He's pretty, average. you know, He's I'll, average I'll use fuck. him. I'd say at least A, but I'll, I'll work with B because he really doesn't have many other redeeming qualities, to be honest. He doesn't even have a fucking character arc. He's just <laughs> like, oh shit, Mario? I'm named after you. Let's go. Oh <laughs> shit, our adventure's over? Alright, Mario, bye. I'm going home. He's the Chris Thorndike of Paper Mario. That's literally it, huh? From Sonic X? Yeah, the Sonic X kid. He's the, no. it's the same shit. Oh man, Sonic! Oh no, Sonic! Alright, bye, Sonic! <laughs> <laughs> it's the same character! Do you guys remember in that, like, the sequel season where they went to space? They brought Chris Thorndike to their world, and he, but he was like 25, and they de-aged him? Yeah. <laughs> yeah, yeah, which sucks because he's like, I'm 25 now. I spent my whole life training for Sonic, and now you know he's a kid again. No, he's a kid again. It's got like. <laughs> karate kick Harley, robot. you gonna say anything? I have Are nothing to here? say about Goombario. That's what I'm saying. He's kind of boring. Like I can't think of anything to say about him. He's just okay. He's Leave just okay. this man in B tier. Cooper. Hello, Goombario. Uh, better- Below? Than... What the fuck? Whoa, hold on. Okay, do you not see this man's nice, fresh coat of paint on his shell? That nice blue, the matching sneaks, the, the fucking arm wrist, that bandana? Look, so if we're like to rate him like on his looks based on like how a Koopa looks, like he's a pretty cool Koopa, right? He's a cool ass Koopa. He's okay. He wants to be an archaeologist. And he actually does it! He gets to be an archaeologist, god He's damn. got goals! He's got aspirations! 
She's way cooler than Goombario. He's kind of like a visual mess. What? What? Yeah. The, the the like band aid is like it is like I don't know how to say this. There's something about the band aid on a sheet that's bothering me. He doesn't band aid have... is it's a little good. much, but it's only on one side. It's also not even you... on his sprite. This is just part of the picture. I don't know why it's there. But this is like oh, official fuck. art, bro. I think you're right. Yeah, yeah. Official art. We're rating the character based on everything. Every this aspect one. of the character. Then, then we could pull up fucking rule thirty four of Goombella oh, and rate is, that. Like, this is a bit <laughs> hard guys. We'll get there. I will say those like his back two abilities are kind of trash. So like fire shell what? does like good damage. Like it, it hits everyone on the ground. It right? does do extra damage to IS enemies though. It's it's niche. It's niche. And dizzy shell, dizzy shell also feels pretty niche. If it's work, if it works, there are some enemies that like will just get totally trashed by Dizzy. I'm, I'm always a fan of the, if they're dead, they can't hurt you though. Oh. And Dizzy Shell, I don't think does any damage. Yeah, it not doing damage is what made me not use it. Like four AP for no damage. Yeah, just for a chance to Dizzy them, it's Power Shell though, for the early part of the game, if you just want a cheap, you know, hit everything, you know, if they're all grounded, like Power Shell is the way to go. Yeah, and you can double up with the Quake Hammers real good. Plus he's cool. He is kind of cool. I'd still put him below Gumbario because Gumbario doesn't have any situations where you're like, oops, looks like you just don't get to have a turn. But Cooper can get that probably a lot. I'm sure there's plenty of instances in the game where there's only flying enemies. Oh, well, let's talk about bosses. Like there's some bosses that are in the air that Coops literally can't do anything to. There's a lot of bosses that Coops just doesn't do dick against. Oh, like yeah. he, he's actually just unusable. A lot of guard. Yeah, okay. He doesn't do, he's just a mob fighter basically. I would rather have Gumbario going into a boss fight and you pretty much gotta have goombario if you don't have a peekaboo oh, well, right. then you can yeah then you can tattle bomb bet bomb bet i'd rather have her in the boss over goombario I yeah if we're keeping with the boss strat yeah but i'll tell you one thing i don't remember a damn thing about she's cute no one does her wind she's up toy a is a heart bomb. is that's all you need sometimes she does have mega bomb you Should know, have... that's a sh that's a shitload of FP. A lot but... of damage, a lot of FP. Screen clear. That's all just different levels of explosion. Yeah. Kind of one note. Kind of boring. But she's cute. How far can cute carry? I don't know. How far can it carry? It's a great fucking question. Uh, I did some Cooper math. He basically can't interact with like a third of the enemies in the game. Oh, wait, hold on. I may mean, have to go down to C tier. Like, there's like a third of the enemies in the game that he basically can't do shit against. Like, at base. And there's multiple boxes. F f skirt! Yeah, you better fucking mute yourself. I heard that shit. That's going in the video this time. Fuck off. Alright, okay, I forgot that I had a spoon in my coffee. <laughs> I'm, going... I'm serious. That was all just poorly coincidental. <sighs> I'm trying so hard to think about Bombette, but I literally can't think of anything again. The, a lot of things about this, these these partners is that I think a big factor is going to be how many enemies can they actually hit, and also how much damage do they actually do in one hit, because one or two defense is suddenly a big difference. Unless so you're later in the game, they're upgraded. We're not even done with Cooper guys, right? I thought we were. We talked about his field ability much, right? Oh! Jump right. on me very... and... Me out there. He solves puzzles. Brian, you're <laughs> cutting out a lot. What's up? <laughs> so are we dunking Cooper to C tier? He can't do oh. anything against a third of the game. And so several bosses and many bosses. <laughs> yeah, besides mob <laughs> battles, he just gets phased out way quicker than uh Gumbario. Alright, back to bomb bet. Are we saying like Around Cooper, are we saying worse than in Gumbario? I think like one hundred percent better than than Cooper for sure. Her FP, all her moves cost a lot of FP. Like when we talk about Power Bomb, though, like that does a lot of damage to everything on the ground. Like that's like the superior Fire Shell for a little bit more FP, but you get it earlier in the game too. Yeah, but like, how many times do you really want to be just nuking the whole board? Every single time I have the the honey syrup that I picked up on on the road, or the yeah. maple syrup that the enemy dropped, or yeah, like, but you go like through a lot of fights yeah but you can just destroy them all and then like you'll level up because you got a lot of xp and you're it's efficient you know these are a life. lot of these are a lot of ifs if you're like, being like a really big like like fp saving slot then like then just having gone but like i, I just rather have go mario out but you shouldn't be saving all your fp because there's going to be a heart block in the next room anyway right should also mention aesthetically 
her fuse is a ponytail. I will say though, like her her basic attack thing is just kind of like I hate it. It, it. It's it's like pretty like one of the worst like basic attacks if you ask me. Not as good as the body slam in the next game. We won't yeah. talk about that yet. It's it's not time for that yet. It's too soon. <laughs> it's too, but it's on the horizon. They're on the horizon. Holy shit. Once again, you know, field ability mostly used for solving puzzles can be used to start a fight with a strong attack, but it is kind of hard to hit enemies sometimes and can just get you first struck sometimes. But, above, you know, I'd, I'd say above Goombario. Yeah, just I'd, say above use, Goombario I'd use her more than Goombario in fights. Yeah, All right, Paracary? Paracary? Just go back to him too. Two and a half minutes. Paracary? Paracary? Uh, wait. Face. Best Before, partner. Wait, wait, hold on. Wait, wait. wait. What's up, Harley? Before, I think we should maybe move Cooper and Gumbario one tier. Up? Down. Oh. Just so we have, like, you know, not everyone's just B tier. Yeah, yeah I feel like if Gumbario and Bombette are the B tier benchmark, everyone's gonna be B tier or above. Paracarry! The mailman. It's mail time! I hate this guy. This I guy's a him. loser. He's way better than Cooper. What the okay, fuck? Like, Why is no one like Cooper? Personality-wise, I don't really like Perry Gary very much. He's just a fucking male dude who, you know, can't do anything himself. Do you think he even realized they were, like, in Bowser's castle or saving the world? Or do you think he honestly, truly just believed Mario was helping him find letters the whole time? Like, he's just a male Koopa, dude. I mean, like, I guess he's kind of cool looking. Like, he's like, he has, like, that classic, like, paratrooper type thing that, like, they starred within, like, Super Mario RPG or whatever, right? It's got that nice teal shell. I hate his look and his personality. I hate everything about him. He's my least favorite character in the first game. I do have one problem where he's literally Cooper 2. Like they could have chosen a different like race of character to like represent uh, everyone in 64, but they chose another Koopa. All right, worse than Cooper? Mm. Better than Cooper. Well, let's talk about his stuff, right? Like In combat, he's better than Cooper. Uh, his, honestly, the way, Pi, the way you feel about Bombette's attack, I feel the exact same way about, uh, Paracarry's basic attack. Yeah, I kind of do it, too. It also has a, a weird timing. It's a sky hammer, it's based. No, it kicks it them. It just kicks them. But that's where you go in with his shell shot, which is a fantastic move. It is a very good move. It does good damage. It starts yeah. out with good damage, and it can basically hit every enemy in the game. He does have airlift, just maybe it's to kill. I maybe that, like, it, it's just it's just whack. It's you just don't get whack. experience for it. What's his last move? Air raid? I don't remember. Airlift is everything. Kill. It actually does okay damage. It's just like it does hit everything. I think it just does less than Mega Bomb. I feel like he gets phased out super hard by the time you get that. I've never. I don't think I've ever used air raid. That's what I'm talking I about. Well, maybe I'm underrating him. Maybe it's like secretly based. I don't know. I don't know. I'd say he's like below Goombario or, or like above Cooper. It's, he's not. He's even getting out of no fucking D tier. I don't even see how he's better than Cooper. He's, For... He can fight bosses. Cooper can't fight fucking bosses. I think Shellshot puts him above Cooper and Goombario. Maybe even Bombette. I'd put well, him above well, Bombette. Like, we just talk about like. For just move, his move? move? This, isn't just, this yep. isn't just a damaged tier chart. Are you in the end of all, Scott? All of these guys' moves we've talked about so far are borderline unusable except for Shellshot. What? Yeah, every single one. What do you do during the game? Do you only use Mario? Yes, I use Mario and I generally have Koops wait because everything's flying or Goombario wait because everything has more than one defense, but then I get Paracarry and now I can play the game. Bullshit and you know it. I put I put that man away. The first thing you fucking run into are those goddamn rock monsters with the spikes. Oh, I'm Paracarry. Well, no, no one's using doing damage on them. You know who is doing damage on them? Mario with Quake Hammer. The yeah, exactly. And there's three of them and you line them up and you Quake Hammer and then you use who? You use Koops. Oh no! Or Cooper. Right. Fuck! Harley, do you have any thoughts in your brain? I mean, my thoughts are racing too much. The opinions are switching so fast, I don't know just, anymore. You, you, Harley, you gotta just start saying things. The only thing I'm arguing for Paracarry for is his shell shot's good. Other than that, I don't like the character at all. Yeah, I hate everything. Like, fucking Reddit! Oh, nice fucking email, Dylan. I. Oh, you going read to it? Shoot! Uh oh! Ooh, it looks like you're ready for interspecies reviewer, dude. Save. <sighs> I hear okay. there's a pretty cool tier list that some people put out. You know, that's all right. Some 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 YouTube channels. Shell shot is good, but 
everything else, I hate him. No it, personality, it's just male. His, his field ability feels so slow too, it's it feels I, like you're oh. just waiting for him to fly. Did I he definitely you, like, belongs below Coops. Cooper. Cooper. Yeah, yeah I'm, I'm starting to feel that way too. I think he's like a little more useful combat wise, but like everything else I like less. Yeah. All right. Good where he is. All right. All right. Bo. Oh yeah. Like that's, that's just that's, like, that's, that's like high tier, like already, like in every single circumstance. Fatty damage. She's, she, <laughs> like she has her whole character arc too. I mean like, yeah, maybe she's like a little bit of an asshole, right? Yeah, but that's but the like, charm. But I mean, like, yes, she does want to protect her people from Tubba Blubba. Like, everyone's like, no, don't go. It's like, no, I'm going to kick his ass. You just got to deal with it. I'm sorry. I'm going to slap the shit out of this man. She doesn't have any feet, so she can't step on you. <laughs> she she looks, like, far different than every other boo, <laughs> like, ever, right? Yeah, she got that nice green, that nice puke green. Honestly, yeah, I like her green. Like, Actually got, like, comes back in the next game. Yeah. Sure. With all due respect, if you, like, look at Goombario, he's a Goomba with a hat in a different face. <laughs> you look at Coops, he, he's got like a different colored shell on it, you know, and he's a little handkerchief, you know? Yeah, he's got the Fred Jones. Bo has like a different like visual, like model size, you know, like orientation. I don't know what you want to call it. Different face, accessories, and has a weapon. How many yeah. people here have a weapon? Mario. Yeah, that's what I thought. Just Mario. All right, she's on tier with Mario. Her, her field ability, the invisible thing, it's 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 whatever, right? It's, like meh. the slaps are good. The the disappear in battle is pretty good. Like there there are strats and shit behind it. It's it's good. It has it's options. Just the smacking, like there is nothing more fun as a kid than slamming your control stick to the left eighty times. Uh, what's her? last ability is it just a, like a, a group party scare no it's her, her first ability it just scares enemies away basically i just meant the last one we didn't know it's a better smack it's a better her base ability yeah yeah no. she got the fan smack i just couldn't remember the scare move that, that, that's 10 damage on enemies that don't have defense which we have come to the decision that you know only like a fifth of the enemies in the game have defense i guess she is based i i was under the impression Bo was actually cringe oh dude but... even i was gonna like read her eye no yeah she's a, she's a good scott look at her yeah yeah okay but no matter how cute you are i can't like justify one attack against that you shut the fuck up you can't say that she's cute she's good good girl i like even I, throws up in thousand year door whatever yeah, that's up. worth oh uh, babies baby. baby goes high okay like from a personality standpoint like probably like a zero <laughs> What? Damn. That bad. You Why spend the you whole that? chapter trying to get the ass hat in your party. Uh, I guess it's like most of it, but it's this baby. Like, okay. The first Fucking I Steam, I closed you! Huh? <laughs> what? 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 She's a girl? Yeah. Girl. Yeah. Girl? Girl. But baby. No one likes baby? baby. I'm not like trying baby. to fuck watch. She's just too cute. What, what do you it, want from me? It's just a, it's just a, it's just a, it's, it's lightning. Ball of lightning and light and field ability of making things brighter. Oh my god, I hate those maps. I fucking hate those. Yeah, the field ability is kind of annoying. They made those rooms because they have what? So like they're one and the same, which is hot garbage. You can just kind of pull her out when a place looks weird. It's just anything weird. It's like Lens of Truth Soul. That's tedious garbage too. All the other RPG games, Mario RPGs, have hidden blocks with no way to look at them. So you just gotta kind of jump like an idiot if you feel like there might be one. I guess, but like hidden, it's still lame. That being uh, said, I don't think anyone could argue with their combat usefulness. Yeah. Pierce defense, but we've already talked about that. Only a fifth of the enemies have defense. And then buff Mario. Just make Mario better. In, but Power Shock, there are a decent number of enemies that you can paralyze, like, pretty successfully. So, everyone hates her personality, but her utility's getting her an A tier? She's not usable in a whole boss fight, so... What? Mm. What? 
Well, she can buff in the boss fight, but she can't do anything to Huff and Puff. Did she really not? Watt assume... and Cooper don't do anything against Huff and Puff. Oh no. Now, to I be mean... fair, it's only Huff and Puff, whereas Cooper is just like all the other flying bosses. Honestly, I would probably yeah. put Watt like below Bombette. Watt and Bombette are at and... least on the same tier. Pretty good. I definitely can't condone Watt being above Bombette. Or uh, below, below. Yeah, it's like, definitely gotta be a bomb. Like usefulness wise, but like I hate everything else about Watt. There's literally nothing I like other than their combat potential about Watt. Is there anything else to these Paper Mario One partners other than their combat potential? Yes, we like, just what, talked what, about Bo. No, you mean okay, okay. Bo is an exception. That's why she has. She's in both here. But every other partner, I mean. <laughs> There's yeah, some that, stuff. She even will smooch you when you like save her from the duplico shit or whatever, right? I think so. Doesn't Bombette do that? Yeah, that's what I'm saying. Oh, I thought, I thought we we're talking. Uh, whatever. Yeah, yeah. Oh she no. Oh yeah. What? Yeah. Remember when you say what and she fucking makes up with Mario? I remember that. <laughs> <laughs> I just hate that chapter they're in. I like that chapter personally. Fucking toys. Don't you got to backtrack in that chapter? A lot. All right, all right, all right, all right, sushi. Fish. I. I Me like too. sushi. Sushi is mommy. Five baby Yoshi's. Mommy's gotta save them. Basically, it. I can't say I use sushi literally a single time outside of the chapter. Yeah, unless she's required for puzzles or that fire boss. She does have some voice lines and stuff in the chapter, but not. Yeah. It's the cheek is out of water too. Imagine like adapting and evolving to live out of water as a, a fish. That is pretty metal. Harley, you said you liked uh, Sush? Yeah, easily B tier at least. Why is that? I just like the way they play. You like moves. <laughs> Can you elaborate? <laughs> They're just good. Which moves? I like Press I like Tidal Wave. Tidal Wave. Tidal yeah. Wave is actually great. All of her moves are good. Like, every single move she has is good. What is it? Water block, belly flop, tidal wave, and, uh... Squirt. Yeah! Squirt! 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 Mario, you wanna watch me squirt? Blech. No. Stop. Pause. I don't think she's anywhere... I don't think she's better than Bombet. I'll, I'll use Bombet as the wall. Bombet is yeah, the wall. Yeah, definitely below Bombet, but above Gumbario. Bombet literally can't do anything except explode. That's okay. Sometimes that's all you need is a good explosion. So she can't do anything other than barf water out. She has utility, she has damage, she has, you know, single target DPS, she has like mobbing DPS, she has defensive support, and she has an aerial hammer. <laughs> and also I mean, it, she it's not an aerial hammer, hammer because she, she can get hit by spikes. I feel like she has just enough versatility that like, what what's the phrase, jack of all trades, master of none? See, uh, the question yeah. comes down to, yes, you can use her in all the fights, but is there someone you would be rather use? Especially like, you've probably got quick change at that point, right? Then you probably just switch to someone who does whatever she would do, but better. Like, she really feels like she fills her purpose in that chapter, and that's about it. I disagree, but I also agree that <laughs> that chapter is basically... <laughs> I disagree, but I also agree. You're wrong, but you're right, and okay. Lack of Lester. You mean Spike! Yeah, Spike! Yeah. yeah. You mean Jonathan. Oh yeah, Jonathan. Who the fuck is Jonathan? The Japanese is cool name. Yeah, it's cool. Cool name with Jonathan. <laughs> Because it's a JoJo's reference. I, actually, I don't think it is. I mean, it, it, okay, it, it is now. What's his clouds name? Okay, I don't get it. Does everyone like him? He's just a cool guy. This guy's a like His moves are pretty good. He makes you move faster like, in the overworld. Yeah, but uh, it's like his, his overworld move is like, puts him up. He's got more girlfriends than Mario does. You know what I mean? like. I don't know. There are a lot of girls that kiss Mario. In Paper Mario. Yeah, like Bombette, so that's why Bombette should go up above uh, Watt. <laughs> Fair enough. Spike is also a traitor. Yeah, but that's cool. Series. 
The traitor part is cool. <laughs> what did you fucking post? Once I got him, I think he was like the only one I used. What the fuck are his moves? He's got spiny flip, you know, damage, throw a spiny on him because, you know, he's a fucking lack of tool. Right. Then he can do the same thing, but hit everybody. Yeah. And then he can buff your evasion. That, okay, wait, pa rewind. Go on, <laughs> one more time. You, you spend four FP and just boost Mario's evasion. So it's just, damn, they don't fucking hit me. Cause you know, I'm a dumb kid and I fucked up the timing on the dodge, but it didn't matter. Cause they missed. That's a good ass this move. Is, this is why I would like rate like sushi lower is just cause cloud nine is water block, but better. Oh. Cause if it, if you dodge a single move during the whole time, they like it's worth more than water block. And okay. then who gives a shit about his last move? Cause it's more just get rid of enemies and get no XP. Yeah. You guys know the, the buffs, the partner buffs stack, right? Like you can have cloud nine and water block. Yeah, but then you're wasting two turns doing that instead of killing the enemy. Oh fuck! God or damn, instead of Scott, you're getting attack with what? Scott, you're getting your ass blown out. All right, is is Lackal I just kind of like slammed him in A, but is, is he A tier worthy? I mean, I love his field ability. I like his character. His moves are pretty good. Like he's a pretty solid A tier if you ask me. I think he should be at least on the same tier as Bo. I, I I use him all the damn time, but I he's still probably A tier just because I like Bo's personality more. I I don't think Lackal Lester. I think he's just like Lackal lacking something. <laughs> Video's over. Here's what the list looks like. Part 2 will be out in a few weeks. Also, I'm streaming Origami King today and tomorrow, so go watch it. Jesus, what was I thinking? <laughs>